daylight, man. I love daylight, y'all. Running from the daylight, from the daylight. I like running. the more and more I like it. Like even what what was the other one? Uh, oh my God, I love that song. Thank you for joining us on my catalog. Today is a special day because we got our boy David Kushner back in the building. And uh, this is one of his new songs and it's called Skin and Bones. This is the official music video. So, yeah, let's do this, man. Because uh, David Kushner is the man. There's no question about it. Man, he already digging somebody out in the woods. <laughs> He's about to kill this. That's what yeah. this is going on. Yeah, he's about to bury this. <laughs> well, it looks like he's already killed it, right? And at this, yeah, yeah, at this yeah. point now, he's just putting the body in there. Yeah, we just get in there at the end of the scene, you know? <laughs> yeah. I love how he's always in the woods like this. to feel you like a bullet and all your layers to the fullest but the heavens won't condone out of control yo this yeah. guy is like man his writing is phenomenal bro like let alone his voice obviously we already know that but that goodness gracious his poetry is like out of this world yo the vo that voice still throws me off man like <laughs> god it doesn't look nothing like him man every time yeah. he comes in it's always like God, how is your voice like this? What yeah, happened right. to you, man? This yeah. guy's been like smoking cigarettes like his whole life or something. Like, it's so like crazy. <laughs> Since birth, right? Right? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. What, what is that baby that was like um, in uh, Roger Rabbit or whatever? That's like smoke that always smokes a cigarette? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> the girl man voice? That's like what this reminds me of. <laughs> yeah, it's so crazy. It, his video is like crazy too, man. Like, oh, yeah. Yeah. The it's, visuals is insane. I like the lightning, the lyrics. Yeah, like what you were saying with the lyrics, man. The lyrics is he's been killing this. You know, you know how he has like different tones of his voice, right? Like the super, mm -hmm. super deep, raspy, and then the deep one, but not as raspy. And then, you know, the high, but still sort of deep, you know? I wonder when he makes all those voices like Daylight, for example, right? When he's mixing all these voices, how does he perform it? Like, how do you... You know what I mean? Does your voice get messed up? Like, oh, like doing that? Yeah. I think you know? I think it's just a lot of practice because like, you know, like even like when comedians or somebody like does impressions and stuff like that, you're jumping back and forth from impressions from different types of voices. I think that's like kind of like what he's doing. Right? He's able to change his voice and like really quickly because like what you said, like his chorus always sounds completely different than like his verses. Yeah, right? his chorus are like way more upbeat and it sounds like a pop, like it's like a pop chorus, right? Super catchy. Yeah. And it's like his different high voice, right? Sounds more, it fits more like what he looks like, kind of. And then you hear his verses, and it's like that deeper voice, and you're like, <laughs> this is a different, like, that's why when it, when I was hearing the first song I ever heard from him, I thought it was multiple people. I thought yeah. that was an actor. 
Like I thought, you know, like how people have like just like an actor playing like the guy, like Jordan Lucas had like the yeah, white yeah, guy yeah. and the black guy, yeah. but it was Jordan Lucas rapping the whole time, and it was yeah, just them yeah. lipping. I thought that's what was going on because it was like it sounded like different people. I'm like, oh, okay, this is a different guy. You and know what? You guys told me, no, that's the dude that's singing. I'm like, no, there's the no wild, way to this dude. The wildest part is the fact that like all of those voices don't match him. Yeah, you know, every one of them don't match him. So it's like so weird that they're all coming out of him. You know what I mean? Because yeah, yeah. none of them match him. I mean, his looks. Voice one though is, is the closest thing to him. Like that, I could, I, I could say, like I could believe, like okay, he could sound like that. But the yeah. other stuff, the other stuff sounds like it's like yeah, an older guy, Johnny Cash. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Like, yeah, that's those are the ones that like really throw me off. I'm like, yes. bro, that swine line was like phenomenal too, man. That poisonous kiss. She has the lips. Red is cherry wine, poison is kiss. She's part of the swine. That was cool. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah I, I'm starting to think. Uh, I'm starting to think he David Kushner is like super religious. Mm. What yeah. is music? He does bring a lot of. Uh, yeah, he talks about salvation, right? And talks about the Lord a lot, and talks about like even like the pupil line, right? We're talking about how she's lying on the pupil, right? Like he does a lot of those kind of like lines, but I think it's because of, like how it hits too. Or what he's trying to like do and like the skin and bones like this is the messaging behind this is insane like i said like his description like not only is the lyrics really good and like how he breaks it down but the, even just how he describes things like just even talking about her place in the slips right being cherry red like all mm -hmm. that kind of stuff like the detail in it is like it's like he's telling a story like i could see the woman he's talking about you know yeah yes. like, even without the visuals like if this if we weren't watching the music video and we we're just listening to the lyrics it's very descriptive it's like he's painting the scene you know? Painting pictures, yeah, 100%. yeah, it's dope. Yeah. I like it. Yeah, it's crazy, and I love his videos too. And you know, like uh, going back to the religion thing in daylight, he was actually out of church too. Mm -hmm. Like you know yeah. what I mean? He had the stone casting, you know what I'm saying, and all of that too. Yeah, man, David Kushner has been raised the right way, man. So shout out to your parents, man, because yo, they raised a great young man, y'all. Yeah, like, and he got a message, bro. He got a voice, and he can make incredible music. So. This guy can't lose, you know. First, I thought this song was about uh death because I'm thinking this is the me death. too, right? He's yeah. burying somebody right off the roof. So yeah. skin and bones, like, first. Like, yeah. yeah, skin and bones. But then, and then I realized, like, oh, this is just about temptation. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It was it was about like giving up your your body, right? Your like your, yeah. your physical body, right? It's him saying like I'm giving up my skin and bones, right? Like it's just a body. So like not to be like you know don't don't live just off your flesh because this is temporary kind of thing you know like yeah. people talk about all the time mm, yeah, yeah 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 that's super fire but I like even the stuff that he does like I noticed he does this a lot and like I mean we only I've only watched three of his videos but every single one of them he always incorporates like sound effects and stuff that's happening in the video like the one when they're walking in the oh, chains no, that's, no, that's uh, dead man that's dead man, oh, dead dead man. man. Yeah, yeah dead man yeah yeah when they're walking right and you can hear the chains from like his ankles and stuff like that yeah. same thing in the beginning of this when you can hear him like actually doing the shovel, shovel right? yeah. you, hear, you can hear the dirt like getting tossed yep. around right? yeah you can hear every time he's hitting you know like, that's in, fire in daylight too he did the same thing remember it starts off with the he hits yeah, yeah. the yeah, yeah, yeah with yeah. the axe when he mm -hmm. hit it it's not it was with the beat you know I just love that because the incorporation just makes it hit harder, right? When you yeah. actually could see it, like and hear it, like that's dope. I like that. Yeah, that's why his videos are so great too. So shout out to the directors and the, the, whoever put this thing together. Everybody who worked on it, you guys are doing great. Yeah, because all of his videos have been fire. You know. I she has the lips. Red is cherry wine. Poison is kiss. She's part of the swine.
he's so he's so smart with how he he does his lyrics because those two lines that like I really caught that caught my attention, I was like, man, those are those are some dope lines. And I think he knew because like he then he started repeating it. Like those yeah. the, the two lines I really liked was that that honey line, right? <laughs> Honey dripping from her tea, and then mm -hmm. he started he started repeating it, and I was like, yeah. oh. I was like, he knew, he knew. I was oh, while he was doing the hook that. too. That was nice. Like yeah. I love how he puts all these like different voices and different sounds. And you know, like earlier you said that the the sound effects. Could you guys hear the bones cracking and stuff? Like there was like bones like through the song, like. Oh, I didn't even I didn't even catch that. Yeah. No. Oh my goodness, y'all. It, it, even the frozen and everything was like all sounds it's crazy mm. yeah it's i caught like crazy. a lot of the other i didn't catch the bone ones though but i caught like the lightning and all the other stuff that yeah. was happening back and you could hear all the different things that he was talking about there's so much going on though it's hard to like you know what yeah. i mean it's because yeah. you're like it's he's taking you everywhere yeah man, this yeah, and I was trying to follow the lyrics too because the lyrics was fire because i even the other the part of the chorus too what he was talking about is this uh is this love the truth right was it deceit Right, like yes. that was oh, fire. That's super right? fire. I love that. Yeah. yeah, yeah, I like that lineup. When he first said, it, "I'm like, yo, that line is fire, dog." The honey dripping down your teeth, yo. Yeah, yeah that shit is so fire. So yo, he has a lot of punchlines in here, like some really good lines, bro. Like, and you know, it's not like the usual rhyming, neither. Like, you know, because mm -hmm. sometimes, like an artist, you can like sort of tell, like you know what he's gonna rhyme with you know mm -hmm. him not at all bro he was like using words that like some words i didn't even know yeah <laughs> you know what like, I mean? his vocabulary was vocabulary was amazing yeah. bro his poetry is out of this world but I, I like though. this song yes, yeah, it it a great song. yeah i love yeah. the message too y'all because this is like it seemed like that he's fighting off temptation and uh lust that's why I love yeah that honey dripping off the teeth yo it's <laughs> yeah fire, it's yo, super sinister right it, it yeah. like, I can imagine a sinister person being like that right you can see the yeah. dripping from the and honey is thick too so it's not like liquid right yeah. it's not just like regular liquid yeah. so you can tell it's like that that slimy you know like yeah that's fire it, that you know you use honey it, it's it's so crazy too because like mm -hmm. on the hook he was like wrap me in your skin and bones right so it's, mm -hmm. it, it, it sounds like a scary movie type of scenario, skin and bones, because nobody says that, you know, wrap me up in your skin and bones, you know? But right yeah. after, he goes like, you so electrical, you know what I mean? So it's like, it's, it's so different, you know what I mean? Like like the electrical part, you so electrical, yeah. and the skin and bones, like, and he put it together like a beast, y'all. Yeah, I electrifying, right? Yeah. yeah. Like he, no, he killed it. Because electrifying would be like a like a mainstream song, you know? You so electrifying. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, but he was like, right? wrap right. me up in skin and bones. And you're yeah. like, skin and bones? And he's like, you so electrifying. I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. You know? That's fire, y'all. I love, I love what he does. He's such a genius, bro, all around, man. Like, yo, this dude, I don't know. I don't know if it's his team. Um, I mean, it's obviously him because his voice is incredible. His lyrics are incredible, and I'm sure he writes his own lyrics. But yeah. like the team that helps him with his videos are just as good as he is in his field, in their field. You know what I mean? And it's just a match made in heaven, man. You guys are killing it. He is like always on point with exactly the messaging of what the song is. Like the song and the video are like one story. It's almost like he creates the video first and then writes the lyrics for it because it's so in sync. Whew. He's one of the top like uh, artists out there, uh, guaranteed. He's fire. Lyrically, sound, everything. Like he's he's phenomenal. Yeah, he's he's the package deal, right? It's it's hard to beat this dude because like even if you can out sing him, which I don't even know how many people out there can can really out sing this guy because he he got like five voices to go. Yeah, again. he's a monster. You know? like, but yeah. even if you get somebody that can out sing him, right, and like out out perform him, whatever, he's got too much in his bag. Like his videos yeah. are fire. His like he could switch it up. He can make lyrics of fire. Look at his songs his that we've already heard. He's not a one, uh, like a one trick pony. He yeah. made a song about m being like having dementia, right, and stuff dementia. like that, right. Yeah. And then he had a so song about being like a dead man. Like, like his stories are like they're, they're all yeah. like completely different stories. The daylight fighting addiction over here fighting temptations. Come on, yeah. this guy's the best, bro. Yeah. Like I love his content and I love where his mind is at, and it's it's, it's mm. beautiful. Like. 
you don't get these type of artists too much that put out so much positive well not positivity but so much like awareness you know what i mean and so much i like would say positivity too because this, this is more positive because you know how many other like this song you're not going to hear another song like this this year but i guarantee you you will hear a bunch of songs of people sleeping around and having electrified, right? What a mess, dude. Maybe yeah. you electrified. <laughs> You'll hear like 20 of those songs this yeah. year. I promise you. Yeah. It's crazy, yo. I don't know, man. Let's roll this. Yeah, how yeah, we intake yeah, information. The things, yeah, the things that the things that like we're like drawn to, right? We we like a lot of like really things that aren't good for our soul, right? Things yeah. that like we hate, like just like the reason why we like certain movies and video games. We're drawn to it, that that craziness. But um, the the crazy thing about him too that I like I, I keep wanting to mention is like, even though his subjects are kind of like serious uh, topics and stuff like that, he actually makes really good songs. Like this doesn't make me like even the dementia song. Like I wasn't sad. Yeah. Like and you would think like just based off the topic like oh dang like this is like a serious topic. But the music is so good and he still has a lot of parts that are upbeat. Even the chorus of his songs like it still makes me want to sing along to it. Like he yeah, does yeah. a really good job of balancing, this one right like, away, giving too. you a message and yeah. making a good song. Because even the daylight song like that had a strong message to it. But that's like a radio song. Like you, yeah. I can mm -hmm. hear daylight playing on the radio. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. But that had like a serious message behind it. You know no, I mean? Very but like serious. That, I could sing that like cleaning around my house and stuff like that. Yeah. That song was fire. Yeah. To be honest with you, I haven't heard one song of his that doesn't have a serious message behind it. That doesn't have like a uh, substance. You know what I mean? Absolutely. Yeah, this guy. Thank you for joining us on my catalog. We just got done being blown away once again by David Kushner. We wasn't expecting nothing less. An incredible song. Shout out to David Kushner. Guys, don't forget to like, subscribe, share, tell everybody about my catalog. Until next time. Peace. Peace.